Hey guys, welcome to another video. Um, today, as you guys already know, it is a cost call. It's a pretty big cost call. It's my monthly cost call. Like I mentioned in my update video, I pretty much said that I'm only going to do like one Costco haul just because it's going to be the big Costco haul. Um, but yeah, so today we do go to Costco and it is football Sunday. So I do, if you guys hear football in the back, it's because it is football Sunday, as you guys can see. Go Paco. Um, but yeah, so I'm going to show you guys everything that we got. Pretty much all the things that we needed was just stuff for us to get by until we leave on our vacation in about two weeks. So um, a lot of these things are probably going to be there until we are on vacation. So we're hoping that it won't go bad. But a lot of the stuff was actually meat that I needed to get for um, our freezer because we actually finished the chicken that I did buy from Costco a few a month ago. Um, and also we need ground beef because we don't have a lot of ground beef. And then I did buy pork chops because I did want to get pork chops. So you guys are all going to see that in the haul. But yeah, a lot of this stuff is going to be majority just for us to get by into our vacation. But yeah, so I hope you guys do like this video. I'm actually going to try to film with my um, new camera that I just got for my birthday. So I'm really excited about doing this. But I'm trying to practice with it with recording videos. But as you guys know or you guys um you guys don't know because i haven't exactly edited it and put out the video yet but pretty much i'm only using this camera for sit down videos and other little videos like if i want to record stuff um but i'm going to practice with it with this grocery haul so if you guys see a difference in quality it's because i'm using two different cameras right now but i wanted to film my intro on my camera because it, it's just easier that way so yeah Anyways, let's go ahead and get to the video and I'll show you guys everything I got from Costco. And start right here. So I did go ahead, champ, champs, I'm trying to sniff my new camera. But anyways, I did go ahead and get a big bag of potatoes. I just needed some potatoes because we have some stuff that we would use for mashed potatoes. And also this one's like made for baked potatoes. So maybe I can make baked potatoes one of these days, but I just wanted to go ahead and get that big bag of potatoes. We also needed some of that dishwasher um, tabs just because we don't have any more or we're actually running low on it so we did finally get the new one. Um, Cody wanted Coke Zero but I don't mind Coke Zero so that's why we grabbed Coke Zero. We just we like having some soda on hand but we were trying to use like either diet or the zero sugar. And then below there we just have some um, water bottles just because we are going to use that on our trip and we just didn't want to buy it like when we're on a trip so we wanted to be prepared. Oh gosh. Alright guys, so getting into the actual food haul, this is everything that we got. I spent about 200 66 bucks on all of this um, so it's a little bit up there in the price but majority of it was because of the meat so let's go ahead and get into everything and I'll show you guys everything one by one of what I got um, so I did go ahead and get this Noma Gourmet um, Kale Pesto with White Cheddar um, it just looked really good it just pretty much is like I needed some more pasta sauce I have like one Alfredo sauce but we have other like tortellinis and then I did go ahead and buy this big bag of pastas um, just because we like having this in hand but I just wanted to try this one see how it tastes sorry if you guys can't really see really well it's just again I'm practicing with this new camera so if you guys can't see everything very well I apologize but we're testing things out here so I did go ahead and get this and it comes with two jars I believe this one was about $10.99 on sale right now so I was really excited because it actually looks really good Okay, so actually getting into the meat. So I did go ahead and get this thinly sliced beef sirloin for carne asada. Um, I think Cody was just kind of trying to see what kind of carne asada we wanted or what kind of meats we wanted and we wanted something different. So we did go ahead and get this one. This one is a 2.48 pound one and this one is 19.82 so uh, we are pretty excited to go ahead and eat this just because again it's just me and Cody that usually eats it but we do like carne asada and we have street tacos we love street tacos so that's why we got that one 
And then I did go ahead and get more Kirkland chicken breast. Um, it's just really good to have on hand and I cook with a lot of chicken lately so that's why I got it. And again these are the ones that you can get in pounds. Usually it's 2.89 for in pound. Um, and I got one that's 6.47 pounds and for 18.70. So I grabbed a big pack of that. And then, like I said, I did go ahead and get that pasta. This is the Verity pack that you can get, the organic pasta. Um, so we really like using it. I finally used up all of them. Um, and I like having it with Alfredo, but sometimes I do like having it with like marinara sauce or something like that. And then I did go ahead and get a big pack of um, ground beef. I'm gonna go ahead and put it in separate Ziploc bags, but we need just more ground beef. We just, you know, ground beef is just something that is always needed if you want to eat, if you do like eat meat. Um, but we need it in our freezer since we had no more. Um, and then I did go ahead and get this big bag of Hamunchi's uh, snack pack. It's just something that we're going to use on our trip. So I pretty much told Cody that we have to have a snack for a trip. So we just used, got one of these, this big bag with like the Doritos, Cheetos. This was the cheese one, not the spicy one. Sorry if you guys can hear the taste as you guys are all. Okay. And then below the ground beef, we did get some pork chops. Um, these are just like the smaller ones, but they look pretty fatty, so I think it's going to be good. Um, this one is a 4.98 pound one, and I got this for 12.40, so I'm excited because we like pork chops in this house, and it's a lot, so it's going to hold over me and Cody for quite a while, so we won't have to really buy pork chops for quite a while. And then I did go ahead and get more of those chicken breast burger bowls. These are just easy to bring with us to work, um, especially just because you can heat it up. But usually Cody's the one that eats most of this, so that's why I only grabbed one because typically it's just Cody that eats it. And then I did go ahead, I finally got to eat the, my hands on the clam chowder from Costco. Usually I really like clam chowder and I haven't seen it at co my Costco for quite a while. So I'm really excited that they had it. It is pretty pricey. I believe this one was $13, but I love clam chowder. So I'm glad that I got it and it does come with a big container. So that's why I really enjoy getting it and I didn't mind getting it because again, I just, I love it clam chowder so I grabbed the pack of that and then for easy dinners we just like having like something easy especially on the work week so we just grabbed this crispy chicken strips and it was on sale from Tyson so I think this one was only $8.99 so that's why we grabbed this one um, just because it's on sale and we know that we can just easily um, warm it up in our air fryer for easy um, dinners Okay, so now we're going to go ahead and get into the produce. So I did go ahead and get some of these mini bell peppers. I used to really eat these a lot before when I was in like high school. But I've seen a lot of people put cream cheese and everything but the bagels on these. So I think I'm going to definitely have some of these like right now because I am kind of hungry. But um, I definitely want to try it. And I know I love that everything but the bagel seasoning. I've had it with celery so I honestly don't think I'm going to have a problem with it. But... That is the main reason why I did go ahead and get these mini bell peppers. I did go ahead and get more broccoli florets. Um, I just like having it and I like feeding it to casein, so that's why I grabbed it. And then also it's just an easy like meal prep side or side in general. So I just grabbed some of these. I grabbed the more celery sticks. Um, I want to make more tuna. So I wanted to go ahead and grab some celery sticks so that I can just easily cut them up and then put them into my tuna salad. I just, I like to, I like having celery in my tuna and then also, like I said, the cream cheese with the everything but the bagels. And then I did go ahead and get some organic French beans. Um, these are just easy to really cook and meal prep and then I again I want to have some with like a try new recipe with like parmesan cheese and lemon and all that good stuff so I think I'm going to go ahead and cook that either tonight or another sometime this week okay and then I did go ahead and grab this organic bell peppers um we have a few a few stuff in our fridge that I want to make this with um so that's why I grabbed some bell peppers because again it's always good to have bell peppers because I didn't realize how many recipes I can make with bell peppers so I grabbed the big bag of it so that's why it's there 
And then I did go ahead and get more of these Philippine Island mangoes. I just, they're really bad for you. To be honest, like mangoes are actually really bad in sugar. And these are really bad in sugar. But I like snacking on them a lot. Um, I know that's really bad. But I thought I would buy it because I know I'm going to snack on it on our road trip. So that's why I grabbed it. Because that's technically my snack that I'm going to snack on. Okay. And then getting over here into like our pantry stuff. So not really pantry, but more of like bigger boxes stuff. So I did go ahead and get more bananas. Um, these are a little green, but that's fine because we go through bananas um, pretty slowly. So that's why I'm glad that it's green. And then these are on sale. These are the oil. I don't know how to say it with those triple zero yogurts the reason why I got this was because one it was on sale and two I actually really like this yogurt um it's just it is good for you if you are a diabetic because you, it does have that zero added sugar artificial sweeteners and fat so and it does come with mixed berry vanilla and strawberry so and so I grabbed it like I said it's on sale right now for I think $8.99 for this big pack and then Cody grabbed this. He loves Ritz crackers, so that's why it's here. So he grabbed it for himself. And then under here, we did go ahead and get Uncrustables. Again, that's for Cody. I don't eat those, but it's his favorite snack, so that's why I grabbed that. He grabbed that for himself when we went. And then I did go ahead and get more of these Kodiak cakes. They finally have it at my Costco. They haven't had it for a while, like since the pandemic started, but now that they finally have it again. So... And these are actually our favorite, my, at least my favorite pancakes. I like these a lot better than any other pancake brand. Um, and it's a lot better for you because it has more protein. But I bought this because Kaysen actually really likes pancakes. So um, we grabbed the big box of it because I know I'm going to be making more pancakes like more down the road because Kaysen is now eating more human food. And then the last thing that I did get that I have to show you is this Coffee Mate hazelnut creamer. Um, Cody needed a different a different creamer because we have creamer that Casey, or Cody doesn't like, which is my oat milk one. That's kind of more like, I don't know, he thinks it's more sweet, but I think it's fine, but he doesn't like it. So we got this one, which I don't usually mind hazelnut, but I don't know if I'm really going to drink it because it definitely does have more carbohydrates and more sugar than I need. So yeah, that's what I got. And that is everything I got from Costco, guys. Hi guys, so that is everything that I got from Costco. Again, I do apologize for the quality of me actually showing you guys this stuff. Again, I'm just trying to practice using this camera just because it is going to be my new camera for a lot of things. And I'm practicing a lot with it. So I do apologize for the quality, but I hope you guys kind of liked it. Um, but anyways, if you guys are new here and you guys like Costco hauls, I usually do this at least once a month just because I typically go to Costco once a month. Um, or I go twice a month sometimes, but mainly because of the fact that it is my more bigger Costco haul. So if you guys would like it, I do hope it was enough for you guys to subscribe. If not, it's totally okay. And then for everybody else that's been watching my videos and my hauls, thank you guys again, and I hope you guys like this one. I know it's been a while since I've done a Costco haul, but I definitely wanted to show you guys this one, so I hope you guys liked it. Anyways, I hope you guys are having a great day and a happy fo football Sunday if you guys even like football or whatever. We love football here, so yeah. Anyways, have a great day, guys. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.